Hello, my lovely Libras. How are you, darlings? I hope everyone is doing well. Libra, welcome to the third week in March. Third week, loves three, three. Look at that. We are moving this week into a whole new season, the opposite of your zodiac sign, Aries. The spring equinox in northern hemisphere, the autumnal on the other side. As well, we have a new moon in Aries. Great to manifest new things. And last but not least, we do have Pluto that moves in Aquarian. Quite a revelation and big changes into many, many aspects of everyone's life, as Pluto is the um, transformational planet. As well, there is a very slow planet speaking. So, slow and steady wins the race, but in Aquarius, might not feel like so. But let's see, loves, what this week brings to you. How are those energies to embrace? And what else? Well, Chariot is there for you. Knight of Cups. Page of Pentacles. And we have a Four of Cups. There is an offer and feels here that you are quite inclined to it. But for some of you, it might not feel good enough or or what you're looking. There's something here that I'm um, not quite into. Chariot, Cancerian energy. For some of you, it could be a water sign. Cancer, could be a Pisces, could be a Scorpio or an earth sign. For some of you, it could be a love connection. For some of you, it could be um, a work offer. So let's see, because it seems here it starts great or comes in a great and later you just feel like I couldn't be better. Queen of Pentacles. The Emperor. Yes, around the, the, full, the, the new moon, the 20th, 20, 21st, 20th, we are entering into this zodiac sign, the Aries. Marcian energy, Tower, also Scorpio, and Nine of Pentacles. There's something here like, is this person married or committed or the way they come towards you doesn't feel like you want it? Because something here is just kind of either it's too bold or the attitude they come or whatever you are hearing or or seeing from from their side doesn't feel like you you want it. For some of you there is a work situation definitely. But as you see here the Queen of Pentacles and the Knight of Pentacles feels like they go differently. Let's see the Tower Death, another Scorpionic energy. Hangman. Whatever here it's done and over, it doesn't feel like it's fully over. Okay, the devil, five of cups, and eight of pentacles. So the situation, clarifying this tower feels like something definitely it's done, but there is certain delays out there. Could be money delays, could be a divorce delay, could be some paperwork delay. There is some kind of delay. And also somebody here needs to learn a lesson. Or whatever someone's here experience they need definitely to learn a lesson. The Page of Pentacles, Three of Wands, Five of Pentacles, Eight of Swords, and Ace of Wands. 
Yeah, somebody here needs a quick fix but doesn't feel like so. They can get that quick fix. So, feeling that my Libras sound like a quick fix but you are not gonna be that quick. You know, so sometimes certain things or certain people in the beginning, they look probably the perfect addition, but they are not. They are not. And doesn't feel here even though... Even though they need to put in effort, they they might not feel like they put in any effort. Somebody also needs money. Again, financial it's somebody's financial decline here or they go to a financial situation, but there is not quick fix. They will take time. Somebody here, what I'm hearing now, somebody here blame or is in a blame game. Instead of putting in effort, they blame the other parties or something, and that kind of a being a turn off. The Knight of Pentacles, Fool, Page of Wands, Ace of Swords, Ace of Cups, Knight of Wands. Yeah, whoever is this person, they, again, it's like in the beginning, they seem like the most caring, the most loving, the best you can meet. And quite enough, it's kind of within one month, they, they show their true face. So from that caring, the responsible, that good person, they they become very very careless or very indifferent or very very immature. So be very careful of where you put your energy into or who you keep around you. Because indeed here someone come, can come and you can start making plans with you. And then that is just words. For you this week, it's kind of like trust actions, not words. A lot of people can talk. And especially this person feels like they, they are the most grounded person. But... This is more like a energy that I'm getting um, a sheep, uh, a wolf in a sheep skin, basically. Yes, yeah, stubborn, very stubborn individual. But at the same time, it's a very, you know, volcanic. What I'm, what I'm hearing, they. You know, some people are very calm, very good, and then sometimes it's just like very loud and very angry, and then they are regret saying things. So this person definitely needs to be balance certain things. Or they said certain things and I regret this and I'm working on this, and then I don't care if you believe it or like... So, oof, it's it's kind of a person to to be aware of because it's not what they say to you, it's what they do. 
was the best advice we can bring to you, Libras? For some of you, it's you, love. So flip the energy if it's not them. Because somebody here acts in a way, then in a whole different way. So four of swords, definitely take your time. It's like somebody here has a temper, a volcanic temper. It's kind of like choose words wisely. Or they choosing words wisely. Somebody here definitely needs to, to choose their words wisely. One card, eight of cups. This could be a Virgo or have Virgo in the chart or very strong earth energy or very, very much 3D oriented. Ten of Cups. It's kind of don't let anyone to, to put their unhappiness into your happiness. Four of Cups. Lovers. Seven of Wands. Page of Cups. It's kind of don't go yourself all in. Test the waters. But it seems here that many of you, you will realize what you want and what you don't in this connection. You know, some people, and we have here the Knight of Wands, the, the Queen of Wands, a drama person. You don't need a drama queen or a drama person. As well, from all these energies, Page of Wands, Knight of Wands, Queen of Wands, King of Wands is missing. As well, Page of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles. The King of Pentacles is the one missing. Just because they, they show up in a way doesn't mean they are the way. I feel here this this person could have um, a, some kind of temper. They might feel like in a way, but they do very different. Again, I see a very volcanic fire and earth energy in, the, in their chart. You, Libra, might have more um, inclined into the watery energy. For some of you, you might have Virgo in the chart, but this person, it's, they could look great as well. They could, could be an, some kind of an investor or they, it's kind of for them, sometimes they need to balance something because sometimes it's, it's okay and sometimes it's kind of like all or nothing. There's something here about this person that they need definitely to, to learn or work on. And that is themselves. Because they could be a great professional. But they might be um, not as good with the the people part so that's a huge challenge for them or for many of you Libras you know some people come in our life to show us who we don't want to keep or who we don't want to be and this person it's something that you you might not feel like very much into or in the long run because starts starts pretty quick but you soon enough understand that you you are not feeling like to move forward or you are feeling that the goals you have or your dreams or your future doesn't match 
with whatever they put on the table. The advice here, we have Mystic Healer. Healing energy flows through you. For some of you, you are a healer. You are very in tune with the 5D energy. For some of you, you definitely are having that good energy. And this person sees that and they can take it from you or they, they could gather it. And we have the embracing enthusiasm underneath shot to the heavens with happiness. This also speaks that it's time to change. And for some of you, you are changing the way you pursue or perceive people or the way you see people. But I feel here this person is that kind of person that you you don't meet quite often in the beginning it feels like it's it's a great addition or it's someone who you want to build something but later on you just feel like it's it's a lot of work to be done with them so whatever they are dealing whatever they are doing it's it's quite different than what you want to do and yeah turning on the healing mode love and light libras thank you so much for coming forward i hope this connects with you resonates speaks and if that's let us know and I'll see all of you next time. Namaste.